The Health of Mother Earth Foundation, in collaboration with Be The Help Foundation, introduced a new farming technique in Abuja for Nigerian farmers. Now, PLOS TV reporter has more details in this report. Diversifying the nation's economy from an oil-dependent economy to other sectors like agriculture has been taunted over the years as the only way to better the living conditions and the general well-being of Nigerians. To this end, two non-government organizations are collaborating with Nigerian farmers to teach them new techniques in organic farming to enable them achieve high yields, at the same time preserve the environment from degradation due to excessive use of fertilizer for land farming. The project coordinator explained the essence of undertaking the visit to Kuali Area Council, where this new method of farming is being developed. This actually shows that what we have been um, campaigning for works. So we have here a practical demonstration of how agroecology actually works, and uh, farmers are being encouraged to um, to transit or to return to agroecology. We say return because it's something that we were doing, um, even though there are new innovations that they're learning about but basically something that they were doing but we are moving away from um, with the advent of chemicals, advent of GMOs and all sorts of things under the industrial agriculture system. The manager of the farm explained the reason for adopting and developing organic farming and its all-round benefits for the farmers, the ecosystem and the GDP of the country. It says the new farming technique is the first ever around the world. For us, we want to practice agriculture in a natural way, which means then we can um, get our inputs from our farm. So we normally we call it zero budget farming, because out of your farm you will get your seeds, out of your farm you will get the fertilizer that will make you grow your crops without um, expending money. So we give money or we try to put money into the hands of the farmers instead of taking it out of their pocket. Participants and stakeholders while embracing the program encouraged all farmers to keep into it while calling on the government to encourage and support the project. Let's all of us go back to nature. We started from nature and if we deviate from nature, we will all perish. Let's go back to nature, do our cultivations the normal way. After all, the conventional agriculture is even more expensive. Why can't we go with the one that is less expensive, with more yield, more income, and better health? So that God in heaven will tell us, you have done well by following my principles. This type of system will be good in my own area, because our own area, you know, is semi-desert. And if we can reclaim that land to become more productive like this one, then I believe uh, a lot of, uh, has been done because uh, many people will get uh, employment opportunity and uh, our soil will be protected and uh, will have a very, very conducive uh, environment that will be good for agriculture. The participants took it all around the facility which covered huge acres of land to learn more while the foundation promised to replicate the program in other parts of the country where the expertise is needed. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.